Hey folks, my name is Ryan, welcome back to the Pokemon Soul Silver and my Slayer Stock. So where we last left off, we actually managed to uh, get a bit into the rounds and then got ourselves two encounters. They were not as special, so we're going to see what encounter is going to be here. Let's see if we can make it to Victory Road and uh, actually get to the league in about one or two episodes. So our team currently consists out of Alpha the Kyogre, Monkey the Primate, Shellshock the Blastoise, Eon the Latios, Bonsai the Torterra, and Volk the Typhlosion. Uh, we just healed up over here, and it's actually pretty nice to have this place, because we can do a whole lot of healing over here, without juicing a couple of our items. But first, let's see what our encounter is going to be. It is going to be... Have I got a Marowak? I don't think I've got a Marowak, so I'm going to catch uh, this guy. One, two, three. Thank you. All right. What would be best case scenario if um, if I ever need to pick up Cubone? If he's, he is currently holding the thick club, because that meaning that his attack is a lot, lot better and he actually got more crit chance. So what I'm gonna call um, I'm just gonna call him Fossil because. He is carrying the skull of his mom on his head. I know it's technically not a fossil. But who is going to be a stickler for that? Let's just be very honest. I'm also going to search around here for a couple of items real quick. Because every kind of item is currently very, very welcome. And I wish to see what I could all get. Nothing? Oh, shed shell. There was an hidden item over here. Alright. I also believe if we go onto the water here, right here, that we still can get another item. Come on, Blastoise. Move to the shitty animation. Rawr. I believe that... That has to be, right? Yeah, here it is. Black Belt. I can't actually use it, to be honest. Because my monkey is already wearing a Black Belt. Uh, was that useless? No, but I could have gotten better. Anything else? Nope. Should have been. Uh, would have been cool if they placed uh, a cave under the bridge. Right, let's just bike up and go all the way over here faster. And use our repel real quick. And just head over, over. You're a trainer, aren't you? Yes. Blah, 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 blah. Hello, I'm an ace trainer. I'm here to battle you and see if you can actually do something. Here, guard jump. Oh, no, guard jump. I mean, I don't have ice beam on this thing, but the surf should do uh, fine. Hey, guard jump! You're overrated! See, you couldn't handle the pressure. Uh, let's just switch over to Eon. Wow, he missed his leg. Now die, please. I hope this kills, because otherwise I would have been in a, I would be in a problem. Yeah, it kills. As I said before, guard jump, you're overrated. Shellshock is higher level, but it actually still does not do a whole lot. And a mana grows. You got some good Pokemon. She. I forgot it was a female Ace Trainer called the Schoolboy. Magro is still cool. I mean, the only... Um, it, it sucks that it actually has a legendary catch rate, because Metagross would uh, otherwise be a crazy good Nuzlocke Pokemon due to its type and everything. But I'm not going to waste so many Master Balls on it when I actually can get a legendary, which, is prob which probably is much better than a Metagross. I know there are legendaries who are worse, don't quote me on this. Especially in this generation, where they did not uh, nerf steel yet. So it still resists dark and uh, ghost. Ah, brick. Yeah, I'm not gonna walk all the way back for a poison. Especially a toxic poison, which uh, the first turn hits for almost nothing. Why is Wallot? 
Right, show me what you've got next. This is gonna do a little bit more. Claydol. Ah. Too bad that I can't keep you in, Shotrock. Let's just go for Alpha. I mean, Alpha is probably going to be the Pokemon that is going to carry this whole lock at this point. Because it's a legendary with insane base stats, six, uh, 680. Another thing I have to watch out for are Electro types, but I'm sure as hell not going to keep uh, Kyogen against an Electro type, unless I really have to. Besides, um, it's too bad that I don't have the Thunder or Thunderbolt TM, because Kyogre can also learn those. It's a gabble. <laughs> Hey kid, want to see what four times effects looks like? And that is a dead kibble because Ice Beam is four times effective. All right. Uh, yes, I would like to. And now we're gonna go. He uh, he said about fighting us again after he healed up his Pokemon. Well, guess what we're also going to do? We're going to heal up ours. Alright, you're in fighting condition again. Um, I think I'm going to actually... I'm going to lead Eon because he's uh, a bit behind on levels compared to the other Pokemon. What do you have so far? I make my final preparation for the Pokemon League. Wow, me too! I'm well, not final. I mean, if you're going to enter the Pokemon League with this level 36 uh, Valplume, you're in a world of pain. Oh, not Xenad, but I actually wanted to go for uh, Luster Purge. Especially since I'm a modest nature. It's still killed, alright. Cool. Bonita, sure. I did not expect that to kill. But hey, I'll take every win I get. Let's just kill this opponent over real quick. And now show us your last Pokemon. Popo. Oh, no, not a threat. It's just free XP. Hello. Goodbye. It was nice knowing you, even though I don't know you at all. Goodbye. And that's another schoolboy Joe. He blew it. You see that? Alright, I know this girl is also gonna give us her number. <laughs> Giggity. Um, but never mind that. But let's see. Weavile! Alright, I'm actually gonna switch for this. Because Weavile is a scary good Pokemon. Alright, let's hope you're actually gonna go for a nice type attack. Nasty plot. Ah, mm. Normally I would be scared, but it's uh, Weevil. Weevil is a physical attacker, and Nazi Plot uh, strength and special attack. Now this is something. Is the crit? It's a crit. Alright, so, so he also outspeeds me. But I kill, so um, no problem. Ian level up, you do nothing, and an artillery is the next Pokémon. Uh, I'm not going to switch into Torterra, because I know that Octillery can get Aurora Beam. Which would most probably kill my Torterra, and I'm not into that. So let's just chop this fool. Can I get a crit? No, too bad. Well, that actually hit decently well. But I'm just going to bonk you in the face. Bye, Artillery. And there goes Schoolboy Robin. Give me your number. Thank you. Let's build again someday. Sure will, if I needed some grinding. A dubious disc. All right, if we... Do I have an upgrade? I don't know. Let's just check real quick if we have an upgrade. Uh, yeah, we have. So if we ever catch a Porygon, we can uh, make a Porygon Z. Which I like a lot more than Porygon 2, to be honest. But that's because I don't like the stall tactics of Porygon 2. I mean, <laughs> who likes stall? I find stall boring, that's it. That's the joke. Alright, head up, head up, head up, head up, head up. And we're going through. What is it? 
Oh, thank you. I uh, yeah, I really do have the badges. Victory vote. All right, there's something uh, really interesting about victory vote, and that's the fact that um, victory vote has no trainers. Well, this iteration of victory vote that is, uh, compared to all all the other victory votes. It has zero trainers because the uh, law of it is that your rival, who you'll battle at the end of Victory Road, has actually defeated all the trainers in here before you actually came in here. But first encounter. Oh, that's disappointing. That's just what I pulse you. He's actually high level, and I don't believe this is gonna kill in any shape or form. I mean, you did confuse yourself. And he just clapped me. Prick. Alright, let's just see what a great boss is going to do. Because I don't think this thing has a high catch rate. Or a low catch rate. I think it's going to be easily caught. That's what I'm aiming for. See? I actually then hope that we have the deep sea scale instead of the two, because if we ever need it, I can evolve this thing into a Gorobis, which is befitting for a female clam pearl. Um, God, what should I name a female clam pearl? It's probably going to evolve into a Gorobis. I'm just going to call you Pearl. I have no other idea. It's a lazy name, but I could not think of anything. I do not want to be... Uh... Oh, I forgot these repels, you dumbass. <gasps> Why did we encounter Clamperl? No, it's an Abrian! I love Abrian! Clamperl, I hate you. Fuck you. God damn it. I love the evolution. The evolutions are my favorite uh, Pokemon. And now we uh, had to encounter an Umbrian after the Clown Pearl, I would have much rather not known that. Ugh. I'm just sad. Pokedol, wow. Let's just head up here, out of here. Hello, I am here searching. A rare bone. Well, that's uh, interesting. It's not. I'm just... <laughs> oh, no. Nobody saw that. I was just screwing up with my controller. Totally honest. Yeah, yeah, sure. Rebel. Thank you. And let's just go up. There's an item over there. I know it. A sunstone. Ah, it's nice. It's okay. Up here. Go down here. I'm up here, which means I have to fall down here, because it's the only way I can go. Move you only for one inch. Go down here, go up here, grab this item. I've done this victory road so many times, I know where all this shit is. Go here, there's nothing here. Go up. Move, move, move. Shut the fuck up, Lyra. Aight, aight, aight. Item. Opalstone! God. I can't use that. Down, up, down, up, left, right, A, B, start. Item. Spell tag, nothing useful, god damn it. I'm actually debating with myself on uh, what the Pokemon team of my rival is going to be, because this could be one of the more dangerous battles, actually. And Reaper Cloth. Did we already uh, get one early in this game? I believe so. It's just not going to be useful, besides I don't have a Dusclops or uh, anything along those lines. Poison Fang. It's an okay TM, but it's not that... Um... Great. To be honest, I don't think I'm gonna use it anyway, so. 
let's just... Do I have anything with Rock Smash at the moment? I don't think so. So I cannot get that last item real quick. So I'm just going to head over into the rival battle. Here we go. Hold it! Are you going to challenge Pokemon League? Victory on his head is hands for sure. But did you notice you didn't see any real trainers on the way, did you? I mean, they were all spineless. Well, the fact that you had to come this far uh, means you're not one of them. But there's only really answer here, because right now, right now, I will crush you. Cool. Hello, Silver. You've still got one of the best rival themes in uh, the history of Pokemon. All right, show me what you got. Radicate. All right, not off to a good start for you. Unless you suddenly hyperfang crit me. Depends on it if you leave the surf. Double edge, but you miss. All right, that's a death predicate. Let's see what else you have to offer us. Mana jam. All right, uh, I can actually leave you in. And surf. Because Manicham is nothing just yet without his Mega Evolution. Hmm, switch to Tekken Defense. It means he's more bulky now? I mean, he shouldn't have lived. Yeah, it's still dead. Alright, still no damage. My champ! That's a starter. Uh, I'm actually gonna switch in Monkey because Monkey has Fly and I uh, don't want to use Volk against with Alpha Plume because in before it actually is a Guts Machamp uh, which the burn makes him be stronger than usual. Scary face. Alright, nothing to fear, nothing to fear because my Monkey is here. Oh, that is way more than I thought. Scary face. Alright. I think I can hit him with a fine type move. Yeah, like that one. Please don't kill me. No! Okay! Whew. That hit a whole lot more than I thought. But monkey lives! Salamence! Alright, now we're gonna get into the gist of it. Show me. A strong boy, you know that? I mean, as long as you don't have Outrage, we should be fine. Ugh, protect. I always hated Solomon's wings. I'm, I'm not gonna lie here. His wings look like they were drawn by his six-year-old. I mean, if they had more dragon-like wings, uh, for instance, take something like uh, along the lines of Megazord Y, the tattered wings. I believe that would have been much cooler. Of course, you have to change a little uh, bits of Salamence's design, but I think that would actually benefit it a lot more, since uh, it would be a more threatening dragon. Alas, the Gen 3 Dragon types are a bit more simplified in their wings, looking at Flygon and um, Salamence. Heck, Rayquaza doesn't even have wings. Did it just... How little did my Lava Plume actually do? Oh, wait, rain! Ugh. Of course, it did nothing. Sorry, I forgot the rain. The thing I'm constantly forgetting about this game that the um, weather effects set up by abilities are permanent, which they removed one generation later. I feel like it's actually doing a really good job against my team. See how much this does. No kill. I don't think I can let. I can keep. Uh, shell shock in to be honest. I think I need to switch. Alright, no paralyze. Nice. And it's just razor leaf, you don't paralyze me. Thank you. Uh, Body slam has a high power chance, so I'm uh, always scared for that. Why not, tank? 
Ooh, flamethrower. Now that's actually a good move. Fuck you, flame will. Dun, 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 dun. Camera ups. Ooh. Oh, my team actually got quite a beating. But it doesn't matter. We still have Kyoko over here, which will just deal out the pain. It's too bad Camerot is not that good, because his mech avenue looks cool as fuck. And he is an interesting type against Firegrant, but um... Yeah, he has a lot of weaknesses. But Fryo, Primal, uh, Ground, and also has those weaknesses, and is a good Pokemon. Yeah, well, yeah, that's because the sun negates one of his four times weaknesses. I've given up training, blah, 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 blah. I didn't get any more halfway through, because I did. I fucked up that sentence big time. So what we're going to do now is we're just going to head over up here. Say hello to the Indigo Plateau. Heal up. And I'm going to buy myself the items to um, take on the Pokemon League. But before I'm actually going to do that, I'm going to grind in between episodes. So uh, we don't actually have to see everything of the, the all the grinding. Because let's just be very honest, watching people grind sucks. I'm gonna buy 14 of these. I'm gonna buy 18 of these. I'm gonna buy 8 of these. I'm gonna buy... Five of these. Hmm. Should we buy more? I believe four swords are the best to have at this point. So that's my setup. Um, looking at my team, I am not planning to change anything before I go into the league. So when we come back to here, I will. Probably train up my Pokemon a bit, but it's probably until they are level 45, so not a whole lot. Because I don't want to repeat the uh, what happened to the eighth gym, and I believe that a lot of the um, leveling can be done while doing the Elite Four, heading up to the champion. So, um, I am gonna look it up real quick, and I'm gonna grind accordingly. So if there are any changes, then you'll see them. But thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye, guys!